Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Thanks so much for even clicking on this video. Today we're going to be doing a quick and easy simplistic back to school look that you can wear to school, to class or whatever, but it's not doing too much, but you still look nice and put together, a little clean, you know what I'm saying, but it's not doing too much. And it's quick and fast so you can hurry up and go to class real fast because I know how that is. I'm actually late right now. So if you want to see how I got this look, then go ahead and keep on watching. If you're not subscribed, please, please, please subscribe. I'm trying to reach 1,000 subscribers by the new year. I really appreciate it and I will see you guys in my next video. So, of course, I've already um, primed or prepped my face. So I've been using... I've been using this vitamin C daily serum. I mix the serum with the Neutrogena Naturals Brightening um, Daily Moisturizer and it has sunscreen in it, SPF 25. And I haven't always worn sunscreen, but um, lately a lot of the beauty bloggers that I watch and stuff have really been talking about how important sunscreen is, which I know, but I think when you black, you just kind of think you don't really need to be wearing sunscreen or you don't have to, but you definitely do. And then right, I live in Georgia, so y'all, it's so hot outside every day. It's like 94 degrees, no joke. So I'm like, ooh, it's hot, that sun, my skin. So I've just been mixing these two and that's what I have on my face right now. So we're just going to go ahead and get started. So for school, um, if I do want to wear makeup or look a little bit more decent every day, hmm, then I'll do simple but still like cute and put together. So what I'm going to start with are my eyebrows and I'm just using the Rimmel London Eyebrow Pencil in Black Brown. And I'm probably going to speed this clip up. Speed it up. Speed it up. Speed it up. All right. And for the top of my eyebrows, I don't use concealer anymore. I just use literally some alcohol and then I just spray a Q-tip. Just cause it makes it look, I don't know. I don't like the way concealer looks at the top of my eyebrows. You know, I just try to do it like really clean. As clean and as possible. Now that I did the top of my eyebrows, now it's time for me to go under the brows and clean them up. And I, then I use concealer. I'm using the LA Girl Pro Concealer in Toffee, my favorite concealer color. But because this is like my kind of simple, simplistic look, not only am I going to put concealer under my eyebrows, but I'm also basically just going to cover my entire eye area. So I'm going to go with my eyelids and then under my eyes for that brightness and to conceal any imperfections. Now I just take like this uh, blending brush here and then I just kind of blend out that concealer on the top of my eyelid from under my eyebrow. Now I'm going to take the concealer once again and this is when we kind of go crazy. And I'm gonna let this dry down a little bit just so that when I, it doesn't just wipe off when I get to blending it. Now I'm gonna take this Dampened Beauty Sponge from Real Tex Techniques, it's a diamond one. I really like this, it gets really soft. And now I'm just gonna blend my life away. All on top of the eyelid. It's just going to give us like a smooth platform. And that's the look we're going for. Smooth, simple. But what I try to do is keep my concealer right under my eyes. I don't like to go all the way over here. I don't like the way that looks. So... I try to keep it right under my eyes and then sometimes I'll take whatever's on the 
bird and come up here a little bit. And then I'm going to take my Airspun Translucent Powder and I'm going to take that, which you can get at Walmart, and then I'm going to mix it with my Sephora Micro Smooth Powder in Deep. And I got this from Aaliyah J, the Airspun Powder Trick. So I just take a little bit of this angled blush brush from e.l.f. which fits perfect under the eyes and mix it so that it's not too light and I set it. Try to make sure I really get in like right under here because I don't really crease that back but I can crease a little bit like right under my eyes so I try to make sure. Now I'm going to take my Black Radiance or Sometimes I'll use my Sleek Cosmetics Contour um, Kit, which looks like this. But today I'm just going to take my go-to, which is a Black Radiance True Complexion Custom Concealer. And I just mix these two on this contour brush. Mix them. Just to add a little bit of dimension into my face. And I'm just going to go right up here. Now I'm gonna set my face. Lately I've been using this e.l.f. Ooh, this is hard to see. It's the e.l.f. Beauty Shield Antioxidant Enriched Skin Protection Daily Defense Makeup Mist. It's supposed to protect your skin against the um, environment, the harsh environment. So. Okay, so we are back, baby. And now, as y'all can see, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> that does attach some attachments. But now it's the final step, and that's just to add mascara. Now, I do plan on getting um, eyelash extensions. I've never had them, but I do want to get them. So I plan on getting those. I'm a little nervous. Um, sometimes I wear fake eyelashes. That's kind of if I'm going somewhere a little like out or somewhere a little more significant than just class. So um, for a second, I had fell off mascara because it gets annoying to take it off. But I've been introduced to this. Y'all, this stuff is so amazing. I don't know what's in here because it doesn't burn or anything. Like you can just pour it straight in your eyes and what even burn. I don't know what this is made out of, but it's literally heaven. This takes off anything. Then I'm gonna go in. This mascara is actually really nice. This is the L'Oreal. Voluminous Lash Paradise. I think they kind of copied the packaging from uh, two, is it Too Faced? Better Than Sex Mascara? I don't know, but either way, this mascara is really nice. Yeah. And a trick. If you really want your mascara to fizzy pop, I don't, okay, whatever. Like, let the first coat dry a little bit and then go back in with another coat. While the top lashes are dry, I'm just gonna add a little bit to the bottom lashes, which I really, I mean, I'm not a big fan, but. And lately I've been really into this like 90s kind of, you know, like the mom jeans and then the good baby hairs and then like a darker lip, not a darker lip, but like a heavy lip liner. My lips low key are naturally already lined, but I'm just going to go over them a little bit with this dark brown lip pencil. I'm 
actually going to add just a little bit of Bobbi Brown highlighter in Afternoon Glow. I'm going to take a little bit of my ring finger, put a dab on my nose. Then I'm going to take just a little bit and that is it guys we are finally done this literally like if I wasn't filming this would have taken like 20 minutes real quick and easy um so yeah if you guys enjoyed this video please 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 subscribe i'm trying to reach a thousand subscribers by january by the new year so please help me out and if you enjoyed my content be on the lookout for another video that i posted and follow me on instagram at say.sophie